My name's Emily Brown. I have been a shooter sport um, for almost 50 years. I am 61 years old now and I started shooting trap when I was 12. So a long time. <laughs> very frustrated, you know. Um, it's a great sport, as I say, it's inclusive. We have um, people from very young age, you know, youngsters, all the way to people in their 80s and 90s. I'm going to shoot tomorrow with a 92-year-old man at Hamilton Gun Club. It's inclusive. We have people who are shooting from wheelchairs or from, um, you know, walkers and so on, because you can do that and you can actually compete at that level, regardless of your, you know, of your challenges, right? So it's, it's very frustrating to see that people are still going to die on the streets of gang violence and there's going to be no impact. We're the ones affected, licensed and rigorously screened firearm owners. Well, here's the thing about that, that buyback program. It literally is aiming to take legally purchased, legally used property from individuals. So do I think that's a good idea? No. Um, of anything, whether it's a firearm that's used, owned and used properly and legally at RCMP licensed ranges such as here at Silverdale, or whether it's a vehicle or a lawnmower or whatever, if it's legally owned and used, then no, it's private property confiscation. I'm uh, happy to say that I am the conservative candidate of record for the Burlington riding here in Ontario. And uh, you know, I am hoping to run again in the next election. And we need to see some real work on crime. Thank you.